This is the Springfield Armory Echelon chambered in 9mm. This is a semi-automatic, high capacity, optics ready pistol that delivers both in accuracy and firepower in a sleek package. Initially, you might see it and think striking design and high end features and you'd be right. The Echelon is for those who want more than just another striker fired pistol. So without further ado, let's dive in. First up, the slide. Up front, you do have a single white dot front post that is raised up a decent amount just off of the slide itself. You have nice aggressive slide serrations with a kind of an L-shaped step down right here. Makes it very easy, and if your fingers start to slip, you're gonna fall back onto that ridge right there, which is very nice if you're press checking. Up top, just a note, there is a logo on it that does say Springfield Armory. That is very cool and unique. Not something I see on every pistol, that's for sure. Just behind the barrel, you do have your optics plate, which is of course begging for an optic. The nice thing here is you do get to keep that two dot rear sight as well, so you can co-witness naturally with your optic that you choose to put on here if you choose to do that. Heading down to the polymer portion of the gun, you do have a Picatinny rail with one, two, three, four different kind of crossbar slots right here, which will make mounting pretty much any laser or light that you want onto it very easy. And of course, it wouldn't be a Springfield without a finely tuned trigger, so let's talk about that. It does have a trigger safety in it, so after depressing that, there's a little bit of take up here, and then you have a nice break. It does feel a bit on the spongy side, but let's talk about that reset. Very soft reset and a decent break overall. Heading up from the trigger, you do have a nice molded texture right here uh, where your finger and your thumb go, making it very easy to find that spot without having to look at the firearm itself. Not to mention, I don't know if you could see that super well, but it almost has a little bit of a shelf to it. That will make it very nice whenever you're firing. You can put a little bit of down pressure with your thumb without it slipping. That same texturing is actually on the grip as well, so very consistent overall. Nice design. but. Let's flip it over. We do have a mag release right down behind the trigger. Now it is going to be flush with the actual grip itself right along this ridge. The nice thing about that is it prevents you from accidentally uh, dropping your mag when you don't want to. Not to mention, this is actually a ambidextrous mag release. Let me show you on either side. It works. That's fantastic. If you're left-handed or right-handed, you can use this firearm because not only are the mag releases ambidextrous, so are the slide releases themselves. You can use them on either side. Heading down to that grip itself. It is the same texturing all the way around the grip, which is not a bad thing because it is a very nice aggressive texturing. Again, it's the same thing that you have right up here as well, which will make for a very nice firm grip, especially after you fired about 100 rounds down range with your friends, you're not gonna be slipping. The magwell itself does have a very, very slight flaring to it, which does assist in actually getting that magazine in there the right way every single time, even if you just happen to miss it by a little bit. These magazines do come in a 17 plus one capacity with a 20 plus one base plate in the box as well. Do make sure to check your listing to see exactly what, what you're looking for comes with. Sometimes manufacturers can change those. In conclusion, the Springfield Echelon is the pistol for those who demand more. It combines aggressive styling with serious performance upgrades. Couple that for a price right around $600 and that makes us a very compelling pistol overall. If you're looking for a full size carry, this might just be the one for you. If you have any experiences with the Springfield Echelon, please feel free to leave a review down below. We would love to see your comments. That is all I have for you today. God bless, stay safe. It is time to end.